Okay, this is uh, the short answer question D from the maths admissions test from 2017 for Oxford Imperial and Warwick. Uh, we're given a graph of y equals f of x, and we're told that one of the graphs below is y equals minus f of minus x. Now, uh, graph transformations topics some people find quite easy, some people really dislike them, but let's think about what they do. So if I have y equals f of minus x, uh, that would give me a reflection uh, that's a reflection in the uh, y-axis, right? Because uh, whatever uh, I had for f of x before up here now becomes f of minus x, and vice versa. So all of these get switched over and we get reflected in this axis. And if I did minus f of x, uh, that's a reflection in the y-axis. You know, so so in the x-axis. Uh, so this is uh, so this time uh, whatever the uh, f of x was before becomes minus f of x. So when I do minus f of minus x, that will be a reflection in the y-axis and then in the x-axis. So we've just got to see which of these graphs that is. So it's going to be one of the ones that keeps the whole uh, of the uh, graph intact relative to each other. So I can immediately uh, discount these two by right, to reflect this one in the uh, x-axis and then the y-axis, now reflecting the x-axis, um, so the, the larger curve is going to be on the bottom and the smaller one's going to be on the top, so it's it's not that one, and reflecting in the y-axis, uh, this uh, smaller curve will be on this side and the larger curve will be mostly uh, on the other side, of the, the opposite way to where it is now, so uh, putting all that together we see that the answer is C, and this is the correct graph. Keep watching, I'll do the rest of these uh, in uh, the rest of this playlist.